Hello! This video is about how to uh, access your archived courses and link your sections together, or unlink them however you want to, whatever you're trying to do. Uh, so under your Courses tab at the top of the page, you'll see you have a See All uh, button here. You click on that and you will see all your current courses and have access to your archived courses if you click on Archive next to Current. And you'll see all the past courses that you've had, that you've created, uh, which is very helpful. So if you've actually created something back here in 2014, 13, 14, you can click into that course and, and possibly find uh, what you're looking for as far as um, you know materials that you've used in the past. Uh, I always suggest, of course, that you create things in your resources. So you don't have to go through and sift through Oh, you know, was that in 2013 that I used that last use that lesson or whatever the case may be. But everything always gets saved so you don't have to worry about it unless you come in here and you delete a past course. Um, and I don't think anybody would really do that unless you're trying to clean this up so you, you have just your current stuff in here. Uh, anyway, so there's your archived courses. If you go back to your current, uh, you have some options here as well. So. Uh, you can add sections to your course. Actually, maybe you can't. This might just because, be because I'm an uh, admin. But um, you you do have the opportunity to, under this cog wheel over here, to link sections together or unlink them. So I already have these two course or this course and these two sections linked. I'm going to unlink those sections. All right, and it does give you a warning. If you're unlinking something, it'll separate those students enrolled into that section and um, any materials from the section. So let's say we used uh, section one as our, our uh, admin course. Whenever we created something in that course, uh, it automatically was copied to section two. Now, if we break that link, anything, everything's going to disappear in section two. You're, you know, uh, uh, so you know, re restore courses to its original materials, unlink and move enrollments into a new section. Um, let's see what that does. Sure you want to unlink the following section, unlink. So now, now you have these are two separate courses. You can click on that one and go to that course. You see that it is empty. There's nothing there because uh, originally you had this stuff here, but I created these materials in section one and I linked the section two to that one. So your things will disappear but of course you can always just move that stuff or copy to other courses and it's you can you know move things that way and it wouldn't be that difficult um, so that's what linking sections does and and so we can just we can link these sections back together so this is how you link sections uh, go to all or go to courses see all make sure you're on the current courses uh, if you want section one to kind of be the master course, click on that option, link existing section. Okay, select the sections you would like to link to section one. There we are, section two, link sections. All right, a little warning here. Materials from these sections will not be copied into section one. Once complete, blah, blah, blah. Uh, so if you have anything different in section two, it's not. It's going to copy section one to section two, not vice versa is kind of what this is saying. So anything that you've created in section two will be overwritten and uh, and so you lose things in, in section two if you've created two the, the sections are different more than likely you're doing this at the beginning of the semester so it doesn't matter um, I'm getting a little bit long-winded here but uh, there you go linking the sections together there it is now these two are back together now if I go into section two those materials should be there in section two as well so these are going to be in both classes or courses there you go linking sections remember course, see all, and you can link and unlink sections, but you have to have more than one section. You will see that there's not, it's grayed out because you don't have two more than one section. 